Good morning. This is uh the yellow one uh back with a, a another video. Um I hope everybody having a, a good Wednesday so far. Uh yesterday was up on Book uh Book City channel and uh so Thompson come up there and I'm talking I'm talking to you because yesterday nothing was you know nothing was I didn't, you didn't give me a chance to talk. You know, you just over talk me and shit. That, that's a telltale sign that somebody's lying. They don't want shit to come out when they over talk. I was quiet. Y'all could see that. Go back and watch it. I let him talk and let him get his shit out. But when I want to talk, he want to over talk me. Right. So that's why I just had to get out of there. But you said, uh, I don't benefit from watching you. Like, how can anybody benefit from watching you? You've been on here on, on YouTube all these years, what well, since 2011, and ain't dropped no jewels. Ain't put out no type of information to help people in the YouTube dog community. You if you go to my channel, I have a playlist called Products, where I talk about ivermectin. Uh, treating your yard for fleas, dewormers, uh, uh, GI symbiotics. There are things that I'm I'm giving people, things that they can use. You, on the other hand, don't. It's just the same old. Put them on a treadmill, let them run, let them shake a rope, and that's it. Like that's what you. That's what your shit is based off of. You at fifty subs, cool for you. That's good for you. And I, let me say this too, before I forget. All this shit about, see, this is how much of a liar you are. And you a capper. You a big capper. All this about you getting money and you monetize now and you eating off you. Brother, just a few weeks ago, you was talking about the checks that you get. It's not enough to fill up a gas tank. Now you want to say I work for you and, and you getting money. You ain't getting no YouTube money like that. You know, so, so stop it. Stop capping. All right, so we're going to touch on this subliminal stuff, right? You talked about me in 19. The first shot was thrown was, was by you in 19 at me. I put out a video. I'm going to check this out. I put out a video in 2019, November of 19. I dropped a video on a Friday night. And in the video I spoke about, I said, if you running champion uh, blood, I said, don't y'all think it's, 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 don't y'all think it would, it would not, it would be a good idea to not advertise those titles online because the folks going to know that it come from dog fight. I'm not talking about you in the show ring and you confirmation. Y'all know what the fuck I'm talking about. We talking about the illegal side of this shit. Right. So I, I dropped this video and I said that I said it would be a, it would be smart to not just advertise online. These people know the lingo. You know, to me, it'd be too much talking anyway on the Internet about the dogs. And, and it's just too much. It's just too much. People just get on here and say stuff that they shouldn't say. So anyway, I dropped that video on a Friday night. You wakes up Saturday morning. Responding to my video. And it was a part in the video at the beginning. Oh, uh, this, 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 uh, these type of videos is coming from bully, from outcasts, bully breeders. You was talking about me then when you said that. You didn't say Yala Kennels or Yala. You didn't say Yala is an outcast bully breeder, but you were talking about me. That's subliminal. Then you mentioned something about CH. They talking about CH means this. You was talking about me then subliminally. This was in, you dropped, I just looked at your video. Uh, the date when you dropped it, you dropped it November the 30th, 2019. It's on there. You was talking about me then, subliminally. Never said my name. So I don't know you, and I haven't done nothing to you. Let's go back before that. That was in November. Let's go back to, shit, I want to say maybe September, October. Check this shit out. This is another. You, you weren't talking to me now on this, what I'm about to talk about now. Triple J, drop a video. Triple J says, 
uh, this, let's just come together and let's just make this a fraternity. Let's just, let's just come together and make this one big fraternity. Said it in the video. You, on the other hand, you came back, dropped the video. The words came across the screen of your video. They asked me to join their fraternity, but I decided to start my own. That's what you said. Who are you talking about? Who are you subliminally talking about when you say they asked you to join my fraternity, but I decided to start my own? You talking about Triple J. That's who you was talking about subliminally. Right? But yet yesterday, oh, I'm direct. I'm very direct. No, you're not. No, you're not direct. That's the, that, that's a subliminal statement right there that you made him. Oh, uh, let's fast forward now. Let's get back to twenty, right? Let's fast forward to twenty. One thing about me, I'm, I'm I got a memory like an elephant. You know, I got a real sharp memory. My memory sharp as a tech. Two thousand twenty, I upload a pedigree where I had took a female. She was like three quarters razor's edge, but she had a quarter of. Uh, Narai's blood and Red Boy Jocko up in her. So I knew a guy that had a, a, a Red Boy Jocko meal. You had in the first four generations. As a matter of fact, I'm probably going to post a link to uh, that pedigree of the dog that I studied her to. But anyway, we had Mayday, Bread the Dragon Lady, uh, Rocky, Cruises Rocky, uh, Hell on Earth, Gabriel, you had all these dogs within four generations. And I had studied to the dog back in 11. So anyway, let's fast forward to 20. I had posted, you know, I had talked about it or whatever. Now, check this out. This is how you subliminally were talking about me then. You was crying. You do your air conditioning shit, right? You climbing up on the roof. You show all these wires and shit crossed. So I caught this shit. You show all these fucking wires and shit crossed up, right? And then what did you say? Oh, wow, look at this garbage. Now, what he was saying, what he was saying was, he was saying that what I did, because I had crossed, the, the bitch had some edge up in her, I went and ran back to the Red Boy Jocko stuff to try to tie into the Red Boy Jocko stuff that was in her. He, called it, he was calling it garbage. Yet he don't talk about nobody's dogs. That's what he said yesterday. That's what you said yesterday. See, so you a fucking liar. You throw subliminals, bro. I mean, that's what you do. Another thing you said. This was in 20. The community page shit. Now, I never knew. Uh, I would see it on people's pages on their channel, but I never clicked on a community. I never just clicked on that tab. I never knew what it was. You know, I never knew what it was. You was on a, underneath somebody else shit talking about me over there. You said, yeah, I saw him hating on you yesterday. They yellow belly cowards. You said that about me. Two people screenshot that and sent it to me. So I'm like, what, 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 what is this? Where was it posted at? They said on the community page. I said community page. I said I seen it, but I never clicked on it because I never knew what it was. And they was like, yeah, that's a way. That's sort of like a Facebook where you can like make posts. I'm like, okay, all right. So you were talking about me then subliminally. You was you was doing the live last year with Brown's Kennels. You subliminally made a little comment, a little a little comment. Oh, when you was taught, you tried to get on the ivermectin shit. Please don't get ivermectin to no puppy. Wait till a dog is at least ten months old. You was some. I had did an interview with Bank Statement, and I told Bank Statement I started at eight weeks old when I interviewed with Bank Statement. So you heard me say I give it to puppy. We all know if an a eight-week-old dog is a puppy. So you subliminally was kicking with him. Oh, please don't give it to no puppy. Subliminally talking about me then. See, last year when I really just started mentioning your name, you know, so we've been going back and forth with this little subliminal shit and wouldn't say each other's name, this, that, and the third. But last year, I was like, fuck it. You know, I'm talking about him. I'm going to say his name. So for you to get up here and act like you don't do nothing to nobody and you just mind your own business, that's not true. You were subliminally talking about Pelican Bay back in like what? That was what, November or December when you did the little 15-minute video? You was getting at him then. 
That's when he came back and started talking about you got boot. If you hadn't never said that shit, he wouldn't even say you got bootleg ass dog. You was talking about him in that video subliminally. So all this, he got his name in my mouth. Every time I look around, you got, I respond to what you say. Do I just watch you like that? Like, nah, I don't just be looking at your videos and, and all this shit. I don't just watch you like that. Triple J said something about the boy shit. I'm going to tell you something. Late in 20 and 22, I had made a post on my community page. Me and Southtown were talking shit about your ass on my post. My post got taken down. I never had that happen in my life. The post was gone. I'm like, yeah, damn, where my post go? Never had that happen. I didn't watch you for like five fucking months. Didn't, didn't look at none of your shit for like five months. I watched it. I went back and, and seen some of your shit when Triple J had said some shit about the boil stuff. It's it, it, it watered down. You responded to him. You responded to what he said. Somebody, I said, so I come and I say, he going to respond to what you say. He going to do a response video to this. And just, just as sure as I said it, that's what you did. You responded to him. So now I watch what you said to him. But just as far as me just waiting for you to drop some shit and, and why I don't watch you like, cause I can't benefit from you. Right? No, we haven't done business. No, you've never sold me a cur. Again, I'm going to say it one more time. You've never sold a cur to me. Y'all let that sink in. He's never sold a cur to me. He never sold me nothing. Not to me. All right. Let's get on. Like, okay, you and the shit you said about Big Hill. Fuck your movement. Like you was talking about they like you was talking about they move. You was talking to these dudes. This is who, who you were talking about. Then when you faced with it and confronted with it, you backpedal and pussy pop. Like, oh, I, I, I didn't know he was a part of you. You was talking about this man, the Shogun movement. When you said, fuck your movement. That's who you was talking about. But then when you get confronted with shit, then another thing, man, y'all be on this shit, bro. Y'all be giving motherfuckers. Y'all need to hold people accountable for the shit they say. Y'all just let people get up here and just say shit and, and they, they be lying and contradicting themselves and don't nobody say nothing. They let they be baby and Tom. Y'all, they baby your ass. Y'all baby Thompson Kennels. Don't hold them accountable for shit. So hashtag accountability. All right, y'all take care.